Philip, what makes a successful trader? Well, hopefully it'll become apparent as you work through this and our more advanced courses, but there are a few fundamentals we should establish at this early stage. A successful trader is someone who treats their trading activity like a business, not as a hobby. Trading financial markets can become a very expensive hobby very quickly, unless you clearly understand all the risks involved. You need to invest time into learning the necessary trading skills, and you need to get to know your own mind. Please don't expect to be a good trader straight away. Like anything worthwhile in life, it takes time. Successful traders are able to achieve consistent returns over long periods of time. Their expectations of return are realistic in relation to the amount of money they manage. The best way to achieve consistency is by seeking trading opportunities that potentially offer a disproportionate amount of reward for the risk taken. In this and our follow-on courses, we'll show you how to do this. The best traders go into every trade with the premise that they could be wrong. They're willing to expose themselves to a predefined amount of risk in order to prove themselves right. It might sound strange, but a good trader will lose money in a controlled way, losing little and often but managing their winning positions aggressively and protecting the profits they've gained in a controlled way. In other words, they cut losing positions quickly and let winning positions run. Good traders follow a complete trading plan that includes entry rules, exits and risk management. They trade the plan, the technical system, the signals, the chart, and the price action, and not their opinions, bias, or predictions. And finally, to stand a fair chance of being a successful trader, you'll need to be able to put these three areas into action. Mind, money, and method. Mind is understanding trading psychology and knowing how to manage it. Traders are subject to two dominant emotions, greed and fear. Both need to be actively managed. Understanding your personality and how to control these emotions that influence your trading decisions is very important. We do touch on market psychology in this beginning to trade course, but we'll work on your trading psychology in our strategic trading course. Money management rules will determine the success of your technical trading system. When you write your trading plan, these will be central to it. Method is your trading style and strategy. How you analyze, read and plan to extract value from a market is your method. Throughout this and our technical trading course, we will help you develop your technical trading knowledge and skill set. The three M's are the framework behind all of our courses. Think of them as the three pillars that you have to build to become a successful trader.